Hello, we meet again. At follow the best channel. In this video just only educational purposes between Christians and Muslims. And this time Mr. Ahmed EX Muslim will give many Muslims educations the truth about Jesus Christ. Now, let's look at what Muslims said to Ahmad X Muslim so we can learn the truth from them. So enjoy watching video. Please share, comment and subscribe this channel. God bless you. Thumbs, thumbs up on, on live. Peace, how are you? Hi, I'm okay, thanks. How are you? I'm Muslim. I was. <laughs> Not anymore. Um I just wanted just wanted to um ask a question. Um because basically so you are not Muslim at all? No, I was. I was a, I was a revert, but um I left when I learned a bit more about the, the Prophet himself and I learned quite a few things. It was just, just a lot to take in. And unfortunately, before before I reverted, I sorry, after I reverted, I learned a couple of things I wasn't happy about that really, really turned me off. And one of the main things was uh, Aisha's age and the Prophet getting with her. And I have brought this up to some Muslims and they do um, argue back with me about Rebecca. So I was a bit un uneducated about it. So um, I'm only getting to know, learn about that side of it now. But it's interesting because someone said to me today. Um, Can I ask the, the brother, what, sorry to interrupt you, brother, if you don't mind me, no, Ahmed, check out where you استلم لا انت استلم لانه انت انجليزيتك قويه بهي النقطه تفضل عاد عاد انا عارف بدك الزيب سو يو سيد انا 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 دخل بي شوي 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 اوكي كان سو يو سيد يو وير يو وير مسلم رايت ناو نوت اني مور يا سني مسلم يا اي واز اي واز نوت اني مور بس نوت بس نوت اني مور رايت yeah, not anymore. That was a long time Perfect. ago, to be honest. I got you, 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 I got you. Say, I do not believe in the Prophet Muhammad nor in Allah. I do not believe in the prophets and nor Allah. I believe in Jesus Christ. Jesus is King. He saved me. He took me back. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. He so, took me back. I just want to, because we get a lot of clown in here so that's why i had to just to test you that's all and god yeah, bless yeah, you yeah. brother no problem god bless you as well brother absolutely i brother. still have respect for i still have respect for people's religion and everything but there has been a couple of times where i did get a bit argumentative about it because it really did turn me off um hearing that but um and we as respect, well, buddy we respect everybody as you said yeah. even we even we respect animal but if I have of a course. dog and I respect that animal, that's, that doesn't mean that me and that dog are on the same level or we believe in the same beliefs. You know what I'm saying? Exactly, yes. Exactly. Absolutely. So what do you want to know? Go for it, brother. It's interesting you use that phrase, though, dogs, because it does say in the Quran that um, like Jews and Christians are dogs. I, don't, I actually don't know about Christians, but... I, it's where it says that about you, so it's interesting you use that. They, they called us by pigs as well. I know that. I know that, buddy. Don't worry. But, um, so basically, anyway, um, so I'm just basically trying to learn a bit more about Rebecca because, but someone did say Absolutely. today. They use that argument all the time because, you know, they cannot defend the argument. Are you, sorry, brother, are you, are you Muslim or Christian? I'm a Christian, brother. Okay, okay, okay. Sorry, I just wanted to double check. Well, okay. Do you, do you think I'm Muslim and I'm telling you I don't believe in the Prophet? No, 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 no. I just wasn't sure earlier who was talking, but um, I'm just trying to make sure I know what I'm. Yeah, yeah. All yeah, of yeah. us here, all of us here are Christian, brother. Okay, okay, okay. Good, good, good. So the argument they use this just because they get mad all the time about yeah. defending the age of Aisha and say, "Oh, Rebecca was three. First, yeah. in the Bible. There is no even one scripture that pinpoint that Rebecca was a three. That's first. Second, the Bible in the book of Genesis mentioned about Rebecca that she used to carry gallons to the camel, and you know the camel, how much they drink water. 
And yes. do you think first a three years old could carry that amount of gallons of water on her shoulder to the camel? That's second. Third, it has been called in the book of Genesis as a little woman. When you call a little woman, that that sounds for you a child? Yeah. Well, so, so, so to me, to me, yes. But um, but apparently that thing about the camels and the water, apparently that she was, yes. Rebecca was three years old, apparently, at that point. Which did but that. at that point, but can th three years old, because that's why I call it that argument. It's always, I have to say, it's so stupid because they don't read. They just accuse. Same when yeah. they accuse Christianity about anything. They don't have the knowledge about the Bible. Or yeah. they use some scripture because they've been informed or go attack with it. They never read the Bible. They don't know nothing because I tell you, if they read the Bible, they will quit Islam on the spot. Again, when the Bible mentioned about Rebecca carrying those big jug of gallons of water on her shoulder, cannot be three years old. Find me a three years old can not fly down. Exactly. Yeah. And again, it's been called little woman. What's mean yeah. the word of woman? Because the Bible mentioned in many verses when, it, when they called at 12 years old a young girl. Yeah, and especially in Mark five about when he rose Talitha and told and, and, and asked her and said, call me, that means rise up. And it mentioned in the same chapter that Talitha was a young girl and was 12 years old. Yeah, so, so there there is, for 12, between 12 and 14. Exactly. So Rebecca being called a little woman. Can you call three years old a little woman? No, exactly. No. So that's when you no. deal. I'm telling you, they have, they are bankrupt. They have nothing to defend. They mm -hmm. always pick on a scripture and an attack. They don't know the context of the of the of the. They're very chapter. very condescending as well. I find is it like a typical Muslim behavior to like when it comes to like a debate or a discussion about it, the differences between different religions. I find that they, they do get very condescending. Mm hmm. And, and um, plus, it's just very and plus, I, and plus as, I, as I said, our Bible is always a talk about a parable, context, a story. It's all connected. If you don't read the context, you wouldn't know nothing. Yeah. In the Quran, it's a different way. One ayah could be go analyze people saying that ayah can you know what you go go again do muta. Then it, it's nothing connected. Yeah. It's not like so you might read the first ayah, it's not connected to the ayah 13. What Bible is all connected. There is context. You have to read the the the, the pad, like the whole passage, the whole chapter, for you to understand of that single verse. You can pick and choose with Quran. Yes, you can, because you can yeah. choose any ayah. It's not related. But you know how um, the Quran they say is like is is um, has never been changed and it's divinely protected. Um, the Quran never been changed. That's what that's what the Muslims claim. But that's what they claim. That's not true, brother. Yeah, because it's been it's been translated many times, so it has. But it been burned. Back in the time of Osman, was burned. Some mm. of the Quran was eaten by a goat, based on Hadith Sahih, and mm. it's all been changed. And even today, our day to day, we have over th between thirty to thirty five Arabic Quran, and even the yeah. one that they have in our hand today. It was published 1924, not even, it is actually 100 years ago, uh, ago exactly. Yeah. But um, the, the Hadith, which they also follow, because that's um, the Prophet's way of life, um, basically, there's some things in there, because the thing about Aisha is in there, in the Hadith. On the way? Right? On in the way? Hadith. In the Hadith. Yeah. And, and the agent even says that she plays with toys, right? But then there is many hadith, Muslims, not one. Yeah, sorry. Go for it, continue. No, no, continue. Yeah, it's like some some Muslims claim that Aisha wasn't nice, she was a different age. And but then other Muslims will claim, because I had a conversation with someone who was a very, very good man, very um, strong with his faith, with his on his deen. And he basically said to me, um, he said, you know what? Some of what's what's in the hadith is rubbish. Right, and he's very strong with his faith. He says, I follow the Quran, 
if it matches, if something's in the Hadith and it follows, it matches the Quran, I follow it. But anything else I don't follow because there's a lot of rubbish in there. Don't believe everything you read in there. But then I, I think that that's just a way to get out of the whole thing about I should be in nine to make it more acceptable that they follow a man who slept with like a grown man with a whole beard with a whole lot of pubes slept with a nine-year-old. Yeah, and, but let me let me give you an yeah, example because that's important what you're talking about. Yeah. If I, if I said myself that the guy be, uh, below you, prophet, his age is ten, mm. and Tande said he's 10. Nosi said he's 10. Uh, Katisha said he's 10. Farushi said he's 10. And 10 people said this guy's age is 10. And I said he's 4. Who do you think telling the truth? Uh, the majority. Exactly. There is not even one hadith talking about her age. And, and the, the marriage got, was consummated when she was 9. There mm. is over probably close to 8, 10 hadiths talking the same thing. Do yeah. you know, and I'm going to tell you this, I know how Muslim think. Do you know if there is only one hadith, one, that talking about that she was six and he had intercourse with her when she was nine, I can guarantee you billion Sorry. percent that will say it's died. Yeah, yeah. Some people but just they, try to go around the houses about her and make a sound like but, she was like 18 or but, 20. But they cannot do it because they will be embarrassed because there is 10 resources saying the same thing. They're going to say yeah. all of them wrong, so they get been cornered. They have yeah. no choice but say it's sahih. And in as well, any hadith that they say is daif, don't believe it. Because if it's daif, why they didn't take it off or throw it in the garbage? Why they kept it? Exactly. Be because it's part of choose. their heritage. It's part of their heritage, part of their yeah. history. They're liars. So they make it die beliefs. because maybe one said about that hadith only they make it die and also do you know another thing that interests me as well is there's, there's a lot actually that I could go on and on but um, there's another thing that interests me as well you know I don't even know if I, I'm quite new to TikTok lives to, I'm quite new to TikTok um, I'd, you know that oh, I don't even know T-E-R-O-R-I-S-T if I spelled that right um is there a certain way of saying on here? Code word. What do you mean? T E R R O R I S T. Is there a yes, certain don't, okay. don't use that word? Yeah, no. Okay, um, okay, got you. Is there a certain word on here for that? Idiots. <laughs> you could say okay, I'll go by that then. So basically, so these idiots, right? So they're so ex like very. I don't even know if I can say the E X T R E M E word, but they're so far gone that basically they actually are the ones who really to the T follow their religion. Okay. And then they get called these, this name. So who's right and who's wrong? Is it, is, is it okay just to follow half of it and not the rest? Do you know what I mean? Because if you follow all of it, it makes you one of those idiots, as you say. Because that's a real Islam, brother. Let me tell you something. Yeah. You remember the time of those people with the black flag? I don't want to say their name. Which one, sorry? Those people, the Muslim people with the black flag. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Those people, they were the only people that they were practicing 5% of Islam. Yeah. Those the closest to the real Islam, brother. Yeah. But not even 100%. That's the real picture of Islam, what they did. That's what it is. And it's scary because back in them days, it was, it was like there was a lot of wars going on, so it was kind of normal to kind of live the way that the Quran kind of promotes, if you, if you like. But um, it just doesn't match today's day and age it just doesn't so that's why people want to argue that i just find that i just find that when you ask a question you make a good point to like a muslim right brother um, we've been telling this truth a long time ago the they west, tried to, let, me, they let me tell you that's that's really important the west never listen they always mm -hmm. say oh racism racist no yeah good no we should be racist 
We've been informing the West for decades, brother. They never listen. Look at today, they're paying the price. Because yeah. they know who they are. And most of European countries start to ban the Quran, but they start to closing the mosque. I'm telling you the truth, brother. They're paying the price today. Yeah. But look look at the look at the it's like Islamic countries, like they're all like I mean look at look at Palestine now. Like do you not think that, that God might be punishing these people? Because I am not even sure if Allah is even a good being. Because like in the Garden of Eden, the devil tricked Eve into eating the forbidden fruit and she gained her knowledge. The eyes open wide. She, he, the, the devil talk, talked Eve into this. And basically, I think that's what's going on now. I think the same thing happened to Prophet Muhammad. I don't think it was Angel Gabriel at all. I think it was a bad being that came to him, if not the devil himself, and do, do, created do, do, this whole system. You yeah. know? Let me show you this. Islam. Let me show you the truth about Islam. Because. Let me open it for you, brother. Yeah. Because that kind of stuff, unless you read Arabic, you will never read it because yeah, they, you never get the moment, proper real truth. Yeah, it's, it's not the proper only because sometimes yeah. let's say you are reading in Quran ayah and let's say you went to tafsir. What do you see in English sometimes is not what you see in Arabic and sometimes you will not find it in Arabic or vice versa, because they don't want to see the truth. I'm going to give you an example, then you will know what I'm talking about. Hold on. Yeah. No, excuse me. I think you're... Can you see? Yeah. Is it related to this? Is it related to what? No, no, no. I'm, I'm, just, with, I'm just with someone here. He was just saying, do you know what I think? But I don't yeah. know if he's talking about this or something else. Okay. Is it do you see this? this one? Listen yeah. to what Sorry, I'm yeah, telling you. Yeah. Listen what I'm telling you. No matter what I'm showing you, do the same and you will know I'm telling you the truth. You go to 81, you see Taqwir? Yeah. I at 25. You see 81, 25? I've got a Quran. I've got a Quran. I can go and get it. One second. Yeah. I've got a Quran and a Bible. Uh, in New Testament. That's one second. The most GM important thing is the ayah. Uh, GM, Habibi, God bless you, brother. Uh, Habibi. Had, uh, had, uh, uh, Allah was La, no, no, Masihi. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Had Ali Akhadu, Akhadu la Jamaat Allah was Nikbar or Ah, okay, okay. Lan Makent, I'm at Samma Halla, Jat, Minch Hamse Day. Okay, Halla, Halla, you were saying? Halla Masihi? Hey. Okay, okay. Do you see this one who said Wama huwa shaitan in regime and this Quran yes. is not the word of an outcast devil? And the Quran is not the word of an outcast devil. Where does this sorry, tell me where that is again, please? AD one twenty five, brother. Just focus with me a little bit, brother here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you see it? Yeah. 881 is, if you're looking in the physical book, Quran book, it's at Taqweer, chapter at Taqweer, Surat at Taqweer, Ayah 25. When you get there, let me know. I mean, I'm, okay, sorry, Sora. Sorry, say that again. Sorry, pronounce it again for me, please. At Taqweer. What is, sorry, can you show me what it, what it spells like again? Because there's just a lot here. I just don't understand. I'll take where once again now. You said you have a Quran book, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just finding it now. I'll take where. Do you want me to write it for you in Arabic? Maybe we will get it? No, no, no. I'm just got, just going through it now. I'll take where. I just can't find it. I'll take where. I'll you have it. You have it. Sorry, it's just a lot that I'm reading. Yeah, do you have an English Quran or an Arabic Quran? English, English, English. So you don't have Quran, basically. But open this, it's okay. Yeah, no, that's what I'm trying to do now. I'm trying to see what you're going to say and then... Yeah, because you have, you have, because you have a sugar-coated candy. You don't have Quran. Yeah. Oh, I found the Alta Quran. Is that the wrapping? Sora 81? 
Sora 81, you got it. 598. Okay. Sorry about that, brother. Take your time. Because I want to show you something I don't think you've been seeing before, especially because you don't speak Arabic either. Yeah. And they, and they don't want to tell you or show it to you either. You know why? Because yeah. they are deceivers. They want to deceive you to don't see the truth. Yeah. And them, you know why they are deceivers as well? Let me tell you something, brother. Let's say I'm Muslim. Ew. But let's say I'm giving an example. I'm Muslim. Yeah. I already proactively knowing that if I left Islam, the punishment is <coughs> I'm alive. Correct? Yeah. So I born with this deen. And that's yeah. the punishment of you, leaving Islam. You would Islam. be an apostate if you left. Exactly. So yes. I'm going to let anyone join with me to join the club. Because if I ever decide to leave, I know what's going to happen. So I stuck. I have no free will. So they're going to try to try to deceive a lot of people to lose that free will and get locked in a cage, that demon, demonic cage. Because they know when you're in, one way in, no way out. Yeah. Yeah, but now, exactly. did you get to the chapter? You're still having a hard time to find it? No, 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 yeah, yeah, I've got it. I'm just listening to what you're saying. But yeah, do you know what okay. I went into it? What you're saying is right because I just found when I did get into it, Islam, the, I had a great experience. It was, it was a beautiful, humbling experience. It wasn't negative at all for me. It was really, really yeah. nice, beautiful, humbling experience. I only turned away from it just because later on down, down the line, a few years down the line, is when I really got to understand about Aisha and the age and and yeah. the, the, the hundreds and hundreds of people he killed at one time, he slaughtered them in groups. And to me, that's, okay. that's not... That's not, that's not, that's not from God. God. That's not from God, no. That's so not you, peace you, from you, there is not The peace doesn't exist in the Quran, not even love, brother. So you see uh, 8125, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I go on that little book here, you see it, that little book? Yeah. What it said... Uh, tafsirs. Perfect. Let's go to Tafsirs. You click on this. What I'm, whatever I'm doing, when you have a chance on your computer, do the same. When you open, no, no. you will see this page. Okay. Sorry. When you open, no, you will I, see I, this. I've got the actual book. Okay. Brother, do you have the Tafsir? Tafsir. I don't even know what Tafsir is. It's up here the, the, the interpretation of the ayah. So, for example, I'm going to give you an example. Read this. Do you, do you know don't read that way, correct? No, 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 read, no, read, no, 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 no. Read, read this. Go ahead. And this Quran is not the word of an outcast devil. So, explain this to me. What did you understand? Um, so, what I'm taking from that is that's kind of. A confirmation that this um, is not an evil book, but I but think no, the devil would lie and make that up, wouldn't they? But listen, tafsir is what the Muslim scholars explain the ayah, not me, not you, not your sheikh in the mosque, uh, sorry, your ex sheikh. It's the scholar. <laughs> so when you click on this, do you see when you get the language? Yeah. So don't, if you open it on your head, if you see it in English, be sure it's set on this one in Arabic. It yeah, looks yeah. like, so when you put it in Arabic, do you see all those scholars? Muyassar, Al-Wasit, Ibn Kathir, all of them, you see them? Yeah. So you go to Qurtubi, do you see the Qurtubi? Yeah. So do you see that tafsir in Arabic? Yeah. I'm going to copy it. Watch what I'm doing, because I want you to see what I'm doing. I'm yeah. copying it for you. Here we go. Copy all the way here. Boom. Copy. Let's go to Google Translate. See that Arabic to English? Yeah. Paste. You see? And yeah. please read this for me in English. That's what you don't see yourself, because it's not in English. Read it. <clears throat> what is the meaning of the Quran by saying shaitan? A cursed, i.e., cursed Marjum, as the Quraysh said, Atta said, he wants the white shaitan who used to come to the prophets, Allah, Allah, peace and best people. Don't worry, Allah, don't worry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the There's form, no of, in the form, yeah, no, yeah, I don't, I don't like saying that after saying Muhammad as well. Um, yeah. In the form of Jibril, and wants to tempt him. 
So basically he's saying that as Shaitan came in the form of Jibril and tried to tempt Thank him. Thank you so much. Exactly. Hallelujah. And tell them to so delight it, us as So it's can. able to copy that. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's basically confirmation that it's the angel Gabriel. That being that came to Muhammad wasn't the angel Gabriel. It was something else. It is demon who showed them to him. It's a demon. And it's Allah, not and, the devil and, himself. And Allah, no, the devil himself is Allah. I'm telling you right now. Mm. Because I, I will tell you why. Hold on. I will show it to you, and according to the Bible as well, you will see it clearly. <laughs> uh, here we go. I'm really glad you brought that up, though, because then I can look, I can bookmark this, and then I can look at it properly. There's still a lot that I'm learning. I, I learned uh, yeah. quite a bit, and I forgot a lot. That was years ago when I'm in my teens. I'm a, I'm, in, I'm 33 now. This was when I was 16, 17. Okay, no problem. Let, let, let me read, you, read this for you, because you're going to be amazed now how our Bible is the truth and explained everything to us, even to the Muslim and the Jews and, and the, the atheists. But a lot of people have no brain. They follow the Satan, they, Satan himself. Mm. Read, read this one, Surat al hakka 43. Read this for me, brother. Here to show you. 60, write it <clears> down <throat> if you want. 6943. And it said, it is a revelation from the Lord of all worlds. You see it? Yeah. Remember, it's a revelation from who? The Lord from the of, Lord the of all of worlds, the, yeah. MashaAllah. Let's go to Baqarah and, and remember what you're reading. Please, it's going to connect together. Yeah, I'm just looking for a pen now. I'm writing all this down. Just one second now. Okay. And after that, you go to Baqarah. And the police focus on the, on the ayah and the remember. Do you know when you have like... You have a pen and paper when you don't need it. When you need it, you have to look everywhere for one. Exactly. Everything, every, it never fails. When you need something, it's gone. And when you don't need it, it's in your face. Yeah. But it's when you forget something about, and then you don't remember it till you're in bed. But about paper and a pen, I don't know how that's like. That's mean you need to organize yourself a little bit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, the thing that, is, I'm, I'm a bit too organized. So I put them in places where... Okay. You don't really need to be you know, now. Stuck now, now, stuck with me. No matter what you need, I will help you. I want you to focus with me, and do not interrupt me because I want you to remember step by step because it's important. Yeah. So you remember what we read first? Yeah. About the what devils. Did, yeah. No, no. What do we? Read, what did we read first? Oh, um. Sorry, one second. Sorry, that's the, the, yes, that the revelation the, came the, from the, the, the from the Lord of the world. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Exactly. So from the Lord of the world, remember, read this, Baqarah 7, read this. Allah has, Allah sealed, has sealed their hearts and, and their hearing. hearing and their sight is covered. Yeah. They will suffer a tremendous punishment. Tremendous punishment. Okay. Let me open this for you in the Bible. Well, I'm ready. I've got a pen and paper. I'm ready when you want to give me this. What? For the Bible? No, the thing that you were saying about the um, two the seven. Devils, but, uh, the, uh, what do you mean? The, the one I just read? The one, the one about the shaitan and Jabra. Oh, the shaitan al-abiyat? Yeah, please, yeah. That's in Surat al-Takwir, mm -hmm. so chapter 81, ayah 25. Write it down. And beside it, put an arrow. You go to Tafsir. Of Kurtubi in Arabic only, not English, Arabic. Um, they want to deceive you, they're deceiver, son of yeah. devils. Yeah. And, and when you find anyway, as much as I can. Yeah. And when you find the Arabic tafsir, you copy paste it from Arabic to English, and boom, you see the real truth. It's not candy, it's shaitan. So basically, it's saying what saying one thing, but it's saying the opposite completely. Is something different. No, no, you, no, no. This is specific tafsir. You when you change from Arabic to English, it vanish. You will not find nothing, not even in English. Okay. 
Like you can play magic and they will think that you're David Copperfield. You're going to say, see this in Arabic? Change to English? Pew, it's gone. They will think you're a magic. You, you might start making money. Mm. So, so now focus with me on this because, again, I ask you to not interrupt me because it's important. Oh, yeah, sorry. What, sorry, did, sorry. what did we read so far? A revelation came from who? Um, the Lord the of the, the Lord world. of the worlds, yeah. Basically, the God of the world. Remember those? Yeah. That's important to remember. And what did we read in Ayah 7 from Bakara? Allah has sealed their heart and their hearing, and their sight is covered. They will suffer a tremendous punishment. A tremendous punishment, yeah. MashaAllah. Perfect. Now, let me go to, I'm just going to connect both Ayah, and you're going to be amazed, brother, about how amazing our Bible is. Read this, brother, <laughs> from our Bible. Um, 2 Corinthians 4. So four. Corinthians. Whose minds, who, sorry, whose minds the God of this age uh, has blinded who? So who is, who is the God of this age the Bible spoke about and called him the ruler and the God of this world, Satan? Whose mm. mind the God of this age has a blinded who do not believe lest the light of the gospel of the glory of Christ who is the image of God should shine on them and I'm going to open the full chapter because it's really important so therefore, since we have this ministry, so we have received mercy, we do not lose heart, but we have renounced the hidden things of shame, not walking in craftiness, nor handling the word of God deceitfully, but by manifestation of the truth, commending ourselves to every man's. Can, can, uh, in science in the sight of God, but even if our gospel is veiled, it is veiled to those who are perishing, whose mind the God of this age has a blinded, who do not believe, lest the light of the gospel of the glory of Christ, who is the image of God, should shine on them. For we do not preach ourselves, but Christ Jesus the Lord, and ourselves your bond servant for Jesus' sake. So, the God of the world, brother, buddy, in the Bible, is the devil. Right. Because Jesus Christ said, my kingdom is not from this earth. It's in heaven, yeah, my kingdom is in heaven. Absolutely. And he called the devil the ruler of this earth. That's why when the devil tempted Jesus, he said, you bow he to tried me to tempt and Jesus worship and said, you can have all of these kingdoms, yes. Exactly. He has the power to give you the kingdom of everything. And that's what the devil shake the, the worldly the, the kingdom, deal. kingdoms. For, shake the deal with Muhammad and Muhammad accepted the deal, brother, because he's coward. And the devil deceive him because he is the Lord. I've of never the thought of it. That's who is Allah. Never, ever, ever thought of it like that. Absolutely, my friend. The devil I tempted really, Jesus. He really, already... really never even thought of it like that. And absolutely, brother, hallelujah to this. this because why the truth. Talk. Uh, brother, let me explain it to this even. This is why it's good uh, to talk. I did, never seen from that perspective to, that he tempted. He tempted Jesus, and, let me, and then he came. Uh, to and let me and... give you even a solid as well. <clears throat> let me tell you something. Muslims believe that Allah, who they think is God, is not God of Abraham. Allah gave the revelation to the Muslim, and you already know it through Jibril, right? Okay, Bob King. Sorry, mate. Sorry, I can't hear you. It is on my end, or you guys hear some echoey sound on his mm. end? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Jaber, yeah. I think it's my reception a little bit, brother. Sorry, one moment. It does this sometimes. Yeah. So can you now, hear me, though? Let, now I can hear you. Let's back to what I was saying and focus with me as well. Yeah. Because I want to deliver this message for you before we switch to our mm. topic, because my brother Isaiah need to teach other people as well. When 
you know yeah, yeah. that Muslim and as you an ex-Muslim, you know that Muslim believe Allah revealed it to Muhammad through Jibreel, right? <clears throat> Correct? Yeah. yeah. Perfect. Angel Gabriel, Angel Gabriel, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Forget Angel uh, Angel Gabriel because it's not Gabriel. It's not mentioned either. So God yeah. of Abraham in the Old Testament. I have a question for you. There is a reason every time I try to explain you to write, try to interrupt. No, I think there's a delay. Sorry. Okay. What you promise right. me when I explain something? Do not interrupt because I find it annoying. I love you, brother, but I'm trying to deliver yeah. this <laughs> Sorry, solid yeah, information. Ahead. Because you're asking me, so I'm trying to talk, you know, you're asking me questions to confirm it. So I'm saying yes, I'm confirming you're asking me, so I'm Perfect. answering. So let me deliver this. God of Abraham in the Old Testament said, literally, if any prophet speak in my name that I did not command him to speak, or believe in other gods, that same prophet shall die. So literally, God saying, if anyone will speak in his name, he should be commanded and given authority from God already. Correct? Yeah. Perfect. In Islam, in Islam there is not even 1% proof, zero proof that God spoke directly to Prophet Muhammad. He spoke with many, most of the Prophet in the Old Testament directly. Like same when Ab I'm giving an example, like Moses, when he spoke to God and tell him, what's your name? Just in case they start asking me what your name, he told him, I am who I am. So he spoke, he heard him. He heard him from his ears. He didn't see, him, but he heard him. He heard his voice. Mm -hmm. Except in the case of Prophet Muhammad, he never heard the voice of God. Zero. So how I'm going to leave his prophet one? Second, the Muslim will tell you, oh, he didn't hear him, but he delivered the message through Jibreel. Now, let's find out if Jibreel exists. When you read the Hadith, Prophet Muhammad himself did not state it from his own mouth that when I was in the cave of Hira, I saw Jibreel. That's a lie. Zero. Nowhere to be found. Because he saw something, scared him. And I'm going to tell you why it scared him, because not something usual to see. So no matter what he saw, he was shaken and he was choked almost three times. And with the confession of the Prophet Muhammad, he said he choked me so forcefully that I could not even breathe. So I don't think mm -hmm. myself that's a behavior of an angel from God. That's no. one. Second, he did not tell him. Hello, Muhammad, my name is the angel Gabriel, the Lord sent me, do not be afraid. Why? He said it in every occasion that he appears in the Bible to Mary, Daniel, Zachariah, Joseph. He introduced himself. He said, my name is angel Gabriel, the Lord sent me, do not be afraid. It's like he's telling him, peace, be, feel, don't be afraid. Except the Prophet Muhammad, he did not introduce himself. Prophet Muhammad did not state it from his own mouth that I saw Gabriel in the cave. In other words, explained to you, he almost choked three times when he told him, read, I do not know how to read, read under and every between that situation, he choked him three times. And a Prophet Muhammad ended up running faster than the Puma. Why? Because he said, my heart was shaking in Arabic, wa fu'adi. Yartajif, when you when you say those words, it's not like you saw something like, wow, what a big wave or something. You saw like boogeyman or zombie yeah. or like he was shaken because he ran to Khadija and he said, Zamilunizam, that's mean cover me, cover me. And he was shaken and soaked. I don't think he saw Angel of Gabriel. Back to the story number one, I'm telling you, he saw the demon, Chaitan al Abyad, the white demon in the cave and Allah himself he is Lucifer I'm telling you right now is the spirit of the devil and why let me tell you why as well to make it even more strong because the Bible said if anyone will teach anything other than the gospel of 
uh, any other than the gospel will have the spirit of antichrist now did prophet muhammad preach the gospel no that's no. mean he had the spirit of antichrist and let's say if it was angel gabriel i'm gonna go with you but let me tell you what the bible said the apostle said if we or any angel from heaven a preach anything other than the gospel we preach to you let them be accursed so you so you can teach any other bible and you cannot uh even if it's from an angel so if it's an angel perfect so that's that let them be accursed then that's in galatians 1 8 go see it in the bible so no matter how you turn the bible is the truth the bible told us everything since genesis and even with the ministry of the lord jesus christ of nazareth he warned us he warned us in the bible he said just to be aware that i warned you ahead of time there will come false messiahs false apostles and false prophets in plural so he made it on that there is no one will come after me period and if anyone will come even if he said i'm the messiah is a false prophet and therefore the prophet muhammad is a false prophet false muhammad had the spirit of the antichrist and a prophet muhammad made the deal with the devil and i hope you understand and you get my po uh, my point and i will rest my case with you and give the talk to my maulana ex muhammad ex muslim masha allah salam alayha in ahabbat salamana wa in karihatu fa salam ala ukhra habib atini bausi bishbina ka salam wa fantastic mutta habibi gm peace and blessing be upon you yes my brother there is a you said something, my brother, but I, I want to come back to this. Uh, my brother, your name? Are you talking to me? Yes. Uh, just call me Peace or Jay, whichever you prefer. Peace, Mr. Peace, brother. Do Thank you. Can you, if you don't mind, open no, don't for mind. me. Chapter 7. Verse number, let me try. In the Bible or the Quran? I believe. Quran, Quran. Okay. 7 143. <clears throat> what surah is that? Surah Al Araf. Al Al uh, the Evelations? Al Araf, yes. Okay, one second. Uh, I wanna, I wanna prove something for you and to everybody here, because yeah. when the Muslim read this yeah. verse, they never try to understand what he reading, like Muhammad. Muh <laughs> Ayah 143. Muhammad supposed to be receive revelation at night and forget it at afternoon and i have the proof from a lot of books yeah okay. even muhammad doesn't understand the quran doesn't understand the quran and i can prove it to you also from here you can understand those book came to the muhammad from other way and counted to make a new religion yeah. so here in chapter 7 verse 143 I will read it in Arabic and we will go to the English, okay? وَلَمَّا جَاءَ مُوسَى لِمِقَاتِنَا وَكَلَّمَهُ رَبُّهُ قَالَ رَبِّي أَرِنِي أَنظُرْ إِلَيْكَ When Moses came to meeting with Allah and he said, Lord, let me see your face. Let me see you. Right? Allah responded, قَالَ لَن تَرَانِي You never see me but walakin but look at the mountain when the mountain 
stop استقر فإن استقر مكانه فسوف تراني when the mountain stop you will see me you will see me so here Allah gave it sign to the Moses when he can Moses see Allah I don't know what they translate let me see what they translate so well good. or appeared yeah or appeared in Sahih International see The word appear. Appeared. Mm. But and when Moses mm -hmm. arrived at our appointed time and his Lord spoke to him he said my Lord show me yourself right mm. show me yourself that I may look at you right mm. Allah said you will not see me but see the but which means mm -hmm. except but look at them mountain if you if it should remain in a place which means stop moving right mm -hmm. then you will what see me right so but when he when his lord appeared to the mountain which which means appeared came to he came right yeah. he came to the mountain which means allah came down from his his throne to the mountain inside his career Creation, correct? Mm. Which means we have the seven heavens, and above the seven heavens, Allah throne, right? So mm. Allah came down seven heavens till reached the mountain. But what happened after that? He endured. Stop it shaking. Level. Yeah, start shaking. Stop shaking. Cool. Their Kharamusa Saqa is not in consciousness. He fall off on his face. Like 